going tonight. Um, I know that we're indoors and we're all really loving this whole situation. It's been super fun figuring out um, who, is I, who I am as an individual and what I do when I'm alone for 10 days um, in isolation. And the answer to that question is I do a lot of writing, a lot of poetry, um, and a lot of singing and playing guitar. Tonight, we are here on behalf of a few different people made this happen. I want to thank B Squared Management, who has helped me a lot in my career, and they're, they're a great group. Um, they currently help me with a lot of stuff in music, and they put together this night. It's called Women Making Music, the Kickback Club. I'm the fir first performer for the night. Uh, it goes on till 9 p.m. You can join in on Instagram. And next we'll have Sarah Hal Harrelson. Sarah Harrelson. Um, and first it's me. Hey, what's up everybody? <laughs> My name is Kendra. I formally go by Kendra and the Bunnies. I'm really glad to be here tonight, and uh, I hope you enjoy the music I have prepared for you. Makes me run across the land and yell, I 
maybe he's a good one. Maybe I'll never know. Cause when he looks into my Standing adjacent to a good girl, you can hear chanting. Everybody is dancing. Everybody was dancing. Everybody was dancing in the street. Thank you. I can hear the claps now. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the standing ovation. I heard you in the back. I will play Freebird. Okay, next we have the song 1776 to 1976. I recently released this song as a live performance. It's online, it's on YouTube for the NPR. Hi, Donnie. The NPR Tiny Desk Contest 2020. Um, you can see that on my YouTube channel and listen to it here and now. Lactic 
Thank you so much. And Facebook, thanks so much for being here, y'all. Hey, Danny, thank you. This is a fun one I have for you coming up next. It's titled A Series of Self. Enjoy.
Thank you. That song actually started as a poem. It's called A Series of Self, Kendra Part Two. And so it started as a poem and it just has this really kind of rhythmic catch to it. And then I decided to put it to chords for a project I was working on where I was understanding reverb and how echoes work in mixing, mastering, and recording. So I put this poem to chords and I was like, wow, this is quite a song. And I really like how it draws on like, the idea of being in one's own mind while also outside of it and an object as well as a person, AKA feeling like a girl in the world. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Okay, great. So this next song is called Well-Toiled Routine. It is my perspective on cultural conditioning in America.
song, it remains the same. Pick up your bones, put faith in place. Cue the trumpets and sign the return. Above and below, I've only just heard. Above and below, I've only just heard. Above and below, I've only just heard. Thanks so much, y'all. The name of that song is Well Toiled Routine. It's getting a nice little groove to it. Yeah, it's got a nice little groove to it. Yeah, I'm really excited to get into the studio and record this song. I should be in the studio. Everyone cross your fingers that society returns to normal. Kind of um, in May, I should be in the studio recording that track as well as the rest of the album titled of Thank You. So I'm gonna reach out and say thank you for being here. Thank you for being here for the live stream Kick Back Club featuring Kendra and the Bunnies. I realize that's, I think, backwards on Instagram Live. And on Facebook, you might not be able to see it, but it's my logo. It looks cool. Shout out to my friend Erin for making that logo. She's with BG Creative Technologies. Great. This next song is titled Requiem for a Night Sky. Get down on it.
six dead tape is spinning. Thank you. Thanks. All right, this next song is titled Home for Shampaka. So this song was inspired by a book I read um, by Ross Heaven on Celtic shamanism and healing, as well as using herbs to cure ailments and illnesses. Uh, this book really, really spoke to me. Um, and so that's what inspired this song, as well as the name of the song is um, titled after the Shampaka tree. And it's been told that the next Buddha would be found under the Shampaka tree. It's a very healing song, and I want to send out some love and appreciation to everyone out there who is going through something, or, you know, everyone out there right now, since I guess we're all collectively going through this together. Thank you. 
Thank you so much for being here tonight. I've got one more song for you, and then I'm gonna send you over to our next artist. Um, next we have Sarah Harlson. Her Instagram is at Sarah Harlson. But wait, I've got one more song for you. Thanks so much for being here.
Thank you so much. So that was technically my entire set for the Kickback Club today. Um, next we have up Sarah Harrelson. This is how you spell her name. Put an at sign before it to find her Instagram to follow, watch next. Sarah Harrelson, at Sarah Harrelson. In the meantime, I am gonna do an encore song for you. Sarah Harrelson. Hey, so I hope you guys are all keeping your sanity somewhat intact from wherever you are at this moment. I have an odd feeling it's on your couch, in your pajamas, and you may or may not have a snack in your hand. Likewise. Okay, likewise, and as I was getting dressed for this live stream, I was like, everyone's gonna be like, oh wow, she got all dressed up. And I was really excited to get out of my pajamas for the first time in like a week. Okay, last song I've got for you tonight is titled Timely Vision. Thank you again. Days we used 